Josh McQuishan of SoonerScoop.com here with Oklahoma's newest commitment, Tory Blaylock. Tory, uh, we got to start, man, with what happened just before the commitment, man. That, that was about as perfectly done on the fake as I've seen. And then to use it for the down was, uh, yeah. I, I think that's going to endear you to some OU fans, man. Yeah, man. I, I, that was my idea, actually. <laughs> but my sister helped make it happen. She um, crafted everything out. So it was pretty fun, man. Okay. Yeah. Now, the balloon was a nice touch as well, man. Yeah, that was my mom's idea. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay. They helped plan everything, and I just came here and, you feel me? Just got made, Yeah, made the announcement, yes, sir. Okay. Well, um, now, you and I talked a little bit about it, but what is it? what went into this decision for you? What made Oklahoma the right place? Um, Coach uh, Venables and Coach Murray and the rest of the staff are just great people. So it's great coaches and great people also. I'm going to be around them a lot, and I feel comfortable um, working with them. Okay. Now, with Coach Murray, I mean, it's been talked about a lot, and basically I'm going to take this opportunity to get you on camera talking about it. But mm -hmm. with, um, you know, you have such a connection to the NFL, obviously his background being there. What, um, is that something that guys like me make too much of that, or is that a meaningful thing to have a guy that you know has, you know, has been there and knows what he's talking about? It's very meaningful. Um, he's been where I want to be, so me getting there, and he knows exactly how to prepare me to get there, so um, I feel like I could trust what he's saying more than anything. Because um, i seen him do it, so sure. things that he's done, he's going to teach me that and more. So that's a really big deal. Just like my dad, you know, he was already there. The things that he taught me to get to where I'm at right now, and I'm going to just build on that with Coach Murray. Okay. Now, uh, Coach Venables, uh, he's a guy that uh, obviously, in, in this era, all the head coaches recruit a lot. They're very active. Mm -hmm. But he, I, I know he's a guy that, you know, he gets you in a room and he's yeah. talking to you, man. He, he's really, yeah. he wants to know you, that kind of thing. What is there? Do you have a story about him that just kind of sticks out, like something about him that kind of says, you know, kind of what he is and who he's, yeah. what he's about? Man, his energy is crazy through the roof, <laughs> man. He came down um, – to visit my school, and we're just sitting in the coach's office just talking. It doesn't even have to be about football. Coach V just talked to you about life, how I've been. Mm -hmm. Just checking up on me, making sure I was good. You know, we just sat there and talked for a long time, so that was a, a good moment for me. As far as the offense, I mean, obviously it's changed. You know, it, mm -hmm. Coach Levy was there when you when you were offered. Now that's changed. Getting to know Coach Luttrell a little bit, what's that been like? And, you know, what's your impression of him so far? Yeah, I like Coach Luttrell. Um, the, the OU uh, offense and schemes not really going to change much. You know what I mean? But I feel like either way I fit in. Um, and he's a great coach. It's been on paper. Like, he's been one of the best offensive coordinators in football. So just can't wait to see what we can do when I get there. Well, man, as a running back, he likes to use tight ends, man. That, that means he's going to run the ball yeah, some, so that works out. <laughs> and, and, you know, I know you've talked about it already some this week. And obviously kind of crazy bookended week for you, man. Set the national record, start the week, and now having this decision here. What – um. Did you guys, I mean, obviously, I know you're shooting for that number, but was it kind of unreal when it actually happened? You saw that number pop up on the yeah. score like we'd done that? Man, it was crazy. We couldn't even really grab the moment for it. It was everybody coming up to us. We were like in disbelief for real. But we knew we were capable of it, but, man, we're going to keep getting it down too. Y'all stay tuned. Okay. okay. For real. Now, is that something just being in a race like that? Like I heard the announcer talking like six of the top 11 mm -hmm. teams in the country were right there on that track. Yeah. Is that just, you know, like you just got a little extra for something like that? Yeah, it gave us push, honestly. Those Shout out to those teams, too, mm -hmm. because they gave us push. They were, we were trying to go catch Duncanville on the outside lane. So mm -hmm. once we did that, we knew it was going to be something fast. Yeah. Well, I mean, Duncanville broke the record, too, man. I mean, just chasing you guys. That, that's yeah. wild. But, um, no, I guess kind of just as a final question, I mean, what um, – the thing I ask every guy once they've made a decision, you're kind of quiet, you're kind of reserved, but you going to be a recruiter? Are you going to talk to somebody? Because I, I know there's a lot of guys in Houston that OU's you know, really heavy on right now. Is that a, that something a part of your plans? Yes, sir. Um, I'm ready to do that. We're going to build a special class, man. This class is going to be really special, full of dogs who want to come work. Okay. Well, again, this has been Joshua Christian of uh, SoonerScoop.com with the man of the hour, Tori Blaylock.